Fire and no, because people are going to be not, roasting not their controllers. Not a campfire, a fireplace. My bad. Uh, no, no, burn pits. <laughs> burn your hopes and dreams. But you know what? Infernape looking really good tonight with a fantastic set win over John Numbers. Yes, that was an absolutely fantastic set. A great upset from Infernape, who has been playing absolutely hot tonight. And I think he's going to be coming hot into winter semis against Burst here. Burst with the uh, the wolf pick, actually. Burst haven't come to us from Chicago, but now a native New Yorker. He's one of us. One of Finally. us. Finally. Finally. You know, a lot of people say that you have to be here 10 years to be a New Yorker. Nah. You get your residence card, you're good to go. You pay your taxes, you're a New Yorker in my book. True. <laughs> That would include Upstate and Long Island. Uh, oh, not, okay. I'm not no, gonna you're right. Yeah, right. Yeah. Okay, okay. All right. We have some <laughs> exceptions to the rule. <laughs> you know what? There's gonna be no exception here. Infernape looking really good until they get caught. Yeah, it's really gonna be on Infernape to push himself into uh, like stage positioning because what we saw in his set against John Numbers was fantastic ledge pressure. And, and a little bit of luck. Let's be what? honest. The barrels to no, bring that the to the barrels, second game. I will die on this hill. Absolute Just like he skill. died right there. Okay. I mean, sometimes you have to feel it. Like a Luigi misfire. Yeah. Diddy Kong mains. They just know when it's going to work. Well, Burst living up to their tag here. So far in the lead. Calling out every approach that Infernape's been doing. Even the up smash? Man, Wolf is busted. Yeah, Wolf. Such a, like fantastic neutral character here with these huge lingering hits, but you want to talk about lingering, the rocket scientist himself, Infernape, still in the building. Does it really count as a rocket scientist if the rockets blow up? I mean, if you wanted them to, then yeah. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Uh-oh. There we go, trading projectiles. The banana potentially going to be given Infernape some presence here in center stage. But like I was saying, good That Lord. scoop from like a mile away. The tip of the toe of Wolf's up, up smash. I think Infernape up was smash, trying to up smash. <laughs> up smash. Up smash. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Infernape is taking that to hearts. Playing much more, much more patient here. Trying to just establish control. Finally, we see a banana ledge. Forcing Burst to actually recover up high. And Fernie hasn't been able to get these huge, like, long strings at the ledge like we saw in his match against John Numbers. Instead, now finding himself at the ledge once again. Back air resetting the situation, but the clap into the up smash. I'll clap for that. That, yeah. that was good. A little bit of one. A little bit of a golf clap. Golf you know, clap. you didn't actually take the stock, but... Yeah, you, you'll get the full clap once you actually yeah. get that uh, last stock. Oh no. Ooh, I don't know if Burst is going to give him the chance as he resets another situation. But the barrels putting him on the other side of the stage is going to get another chance at this neutral. I mean, if they can get oh. back, if they can. Nice little fist to get off of. Don't get Wolf Flash. No, yeah, never. There we go. Oh no, the, with the hard read! Falls out of the forward tilts. And now without any banana, I don't think Infernape has time to pull another one out without getting punished. Yeah, especially the way no. that Burst has just been playing so close to Infernape, just gradually taking this space. So much threat here. All right, not able to set up the banana at ledge, but a monkey flip is going to get Infernape back into neutral. I just want Burst to throw out an up smash. Okay, Infernape, you can do yeah. that too. I, I guess, if you want. Might as well. But you see just what I mean? Just treat yourself. Yeah. You can have an up smash as a treat. As a treat. Oh, <laughs> what and the clank. clank as well, Infernape holding on strong. This is Diddy Kong with Rage. We did see Infernape get a crazy spike to finish off John Numbers. You know, I didn't think that we'd see the sequel to 28 Days Later, like, so soon. <laughs> what What do you mean by this? You know, the, the Rage Virus from 28 oh, Days Later. Okay. It started with the monkeys. Oh. And you know what? That movie would have ended in the first five minutes if an, if uh, Burst was there. <laughs> if yeah, Burst was there. No, I would have intervened. Yes. Hold up. We don't need to release I, the monkeys. I simply would have. I simply would have uh, not gotten caught by the rage virus. That's right. You know what? Infernape is going to take that rage into this next game of the set. 
I think what's really messing them up is that they're not really knowing how to approach in the air against bursts. Mm -hmm. And we're getting clipped by like the up smash, right? I think everybody gets one there. But and Burst is doing such a good job of controlling airspace. Yeah, and I think especially Burst's disadvantage in this game so far has been fantastic. Like I was saying before, Infernape's ledge pressure is so good, but it feels like he just hasn't gotten the opportunity to really play that game. Oh. Okay, jab lock. You the F smash. Stuff. It's good damage. But now just double jumping his way right back to the PS2 platforms. Even with the coverage of the platform, Infernape just hasn't been able to get too much started here. Yeah, Infernape's best friend, the banana, doing a little bit of friendly fire there. Finally, both struggling to control center stage. We're starting to see some more aerial play here from Infernape. A little bit of monkey flips just to get from one side to the next. Yeah, trying to maybe react to some jumps out of shield here, but no burst. Just holding strong in this center stage. Instead, it, it just feels like burst has been the one to just be ledge trapping constantly this game. Okay. okay. The banana into the F smash. Going to be putting Infernape in a stock lead for the first time this set. Unfortunately, Infernape really forgot that, uh, yeah, you have to respect that Angel platform invincibility. I like that recovery mix-up a lot from Infernape, charging the barrels and then going back to ledge. But first, avoiding any sort of extra credit, we are at a dead even game here. That's what I'm saying, though. He gave up all that position a while Burst oh. was, you know, invincible. Like, that was a lost stock because he got hit. Whole interaction. Anyway, seeing this interaction, I'm liking the use of the guns. Okay, lingering neutral air into a forward air. Infernape keeping the moment, trying to keep the momentum in his favor. But first, pushing him back to the corner once again. Great getup attack. You do not want to be getting Wolf down smash there. Okay, a little bit of exhaust there. Singeing the Wolf. I like the fear of the reflector that Burst is putting into Infernape. It's like, you are not going to throw that. I will react to that on command. All right, here we go, setting up a Nana at ledge, trying to react to the ledge jump. Did have the correct reaction, but not the correct spacing, unfortunately. And instead now, it is no. burst. Can he make it back? He does! He is, in fact, making it back. No way! And getting the reversal as well. Infernape once again with a stock lead. Okay, this could be huge. Into the reset. All right, gets out of position there. You know, he's like, Tony Six, I'm good. Yeah. You don't really want to risk a, an up smash there. But first, just really burst on in and took that last stock. So what are we doing here now? Yeah, I love that grab, by the way, from burst. Recognizing, like, just reacting. Diddy with banana just sitting in shield. Yeah, you just grab him. Uh-oh. I think he's going to win. Okay. Never mind. Yeah, and Fernape still holding on to this lead. Resetting back into neutral, trying to find the banana, and Burst just kind of tripping on it. Oh, it's kind of an awkward again. situation. <laughs> and the barrel explosion. But All right, mad, mad rocket scientist, really. Yeah, I don't. I actually don't know about using it right there because it works. Yeah, but you've kind of tipped your hand now at a uh, showing a surprise potential kill option, but. Don't that? need any other option except up smash. Up smash killing, not surprising in the slightest. Well, Burst had to think about that one. He's like, mm, mm, should I have died to that? I don't think so. Uh, well, I don't know. Uh, up smash is that high percent. Yeah, but that. what do you think Infernape did better this game than game one? I think Infernape was doing a much better job of catching Burst in disadvantage, just really using that banana like we saw in uh, stock one to catch landings right there, catching a landing off of the platform as well. Burst taking us right back into PS2. Ooh, yeah, he's not really standing foul. Inversion. Inferno is telling him, sit down. Oh! Ooh. Very okay. scary stuff coming out in Inferno. Inferno is hungry for the win tonight. Hungry like a box. Let's see, catching Burst, going for the banana. Such a good sort of decoy there for Diddy Kong. 
Burst not challenging in the air. Ooh. We are starting to see a wall of back airs in the air to stuff any sort of approach. Okay. All right, and another barrel explosion. Get off of me. Now we see the Ooh. collapse. Yeah, Burst, unfortunately, not able to capitalize too much off of the ledge scenario on the right or the left. Fernate fighting his way right back into center. He's often throwing away the banana now that he knows that Burst is going to reflect that on command. Unfortunately, Burst whiffing the grab right in Infernape's face, and Infernape capitalizing on it. Very nice. He just kind of extended his hand. He's like, yeah. throw me into the blast zone. He's like, yes, much I obliged. Got you. Hey, you know what? You smash me, I smash you. We're at even stocks. Burst not one to be put in uh, at a disadvantage for too long. Getting just a very slight percent lead, unfortunately, and Fernie not able to find the, uh, the cross up there after Wolf's dash attack. Uh, such a scramble. Both players trying to punish this out of shield. could be shields. huge. No. Banana for good coverage at the ledge. All you need to get in, though, is one neutral air. Two neutral airs. <laughs> Right, looking for a fair into bear and burst, not quite finding it. It was such a hard read there with the up smash, but it did keep Inferni from actually landing on the platform. <gasps> All right, unfortunately, not going to be able to get too close to a kill there with that banana. Just wrong side of the stage. I was like, he's walking up. I'm like, okay, <laughs> no one walks up with good intentions. Oh, absolutely not. Reading the air dodge out in frame in a stock lead once again. Now one stock away from finding himself in winner's finals against Mr. E. Burst has to slow things down. We know that he won the first game, and he must be feeling a little salty that he's down behind on this last one. For Infernape now having the download on him. Yeah, and unfortunately, the up smash not going to be taking it. No rage on the board for Burst. I like the mix up with the down air. But yep. Infernape keeps coming back. Yeah, Infernape actually the one to really been, be getting like so many mix ups off stage that could have been huge. And okay. honestly, I feel like that has been the story of these ha these two games versus game one is oh, Infernape's disadvantage has been so much better. And once again, finding the banana into the up smash, Infernape is going to winner's finals. Well, that was winner's side, right? Yes, of yeah. course. It's okay. You know what? You don't have to be out in the cold just yet there, <laughs> Burst. We'll see you in Losers. And then we'll kick you out. Unless you see you in Losers Finals. But this was just excellent play here. Infernape was waiting for Burst to throw out that first option at ledge, trying to read it patiently, and just really good convergence into these down tilt up smashes. Just clean, simple stuff consistently. Very good stuff. Someone was watching LMVM. He's like, yeah, Ooh, yeah, yeah you, see, you see the head nod. Meanwhile, Burst it's just kind of sitting there being like, it happens. Yeah. It's all right. It happens to the best of us. That's right. Even the worst of us.